Hi folks, how are you going? Welcome back to another HP Gaming Game Link video. Today we've got something a little bit extra special, a little bit exclusive, and a little bit Kickstarter-y for you. We have here a magical box of awesome, and Charlotte doesn't know what's inside the box, but I'm happy to tell you that we will be uh, brandishing our unicorns, gathering out together our troops, and taking the fight to the dungeons in Rummy Buddies, here to slay. Hi folks, how are you going? Welcome back to another HP Gaming Game Link video, as we said before. My name is Matt, and this is, of course, Charlotte. and we are here to unbox for you a Kickstarter exclusive edition of Here to Slay, which has arrived on our doorsteps not too long ago. Uh, while I'm opening up this one, uh, just to explain a few, to a few of you, uh, Here to Slay is a bit of a, a role-playing adventure game set in the world of unstable unicorns, which is really awesome. Mm -hmm. There's a few extras in this box that are not the norm, uh, including a few other surprises, which I won't spoil for Charlotte. Yeah. But we're going to get into here to slay. We're going to show you what it's all about. Uh, for those of you who don't know, um, this was something we did on our Kickstarter uh, for uh, June, our first, mm -hmm. ever, our first ever gotcha backer. Uh, and there's a few extra bits and pieces here. So this is how Ooh. it was all packaged there. So you can see yeah. on the overhead uh, all sorts of bells and whistles. They even had a packing slip, which was awesome. But before we get into the main game, uh, we've also got a travel edition of Unstable Unicorns, which is a smaller Ooh. version of the same game. Uh, very slim line. We might even open that one as well. Um, Daddy? Yeah. Um, if some of you don't know Unstable Unicorns, um, the first one that me and Daddy have, well, we've got another one that's sort of different, but I'll explain the first one well. Well, we actually played Unstable mm -hmm. Unicorns on one of our live stream shows as well, uh -huh. which you can check out uh, aspects of the channel there. Mm -hmm. And we've also got the adventure expansions for Unstable Unicorns as well, the expansion pack, which allows for all sorts of crazy adventuring <gasps> bits and pieces as well. Look what I found! I know, you found a few bits and pieces in there. So what we've got here, uh, this one, we'll just jump straight in. This is a special uh, wildlife cuddly pin. Now, Rami and his team, um, we thank you again. For those of you who watched our first Got You Back episode, will know that Here to Slay uh, was first put on Kickstarter during the crazy bushfire season that Australia had um, not too long ago. Obviously, that's, there's a lot that's happened since then. Um, but to help, and leave that in there, but to help support um, the Australia uh, community, uh, the Australian community, uh, Rami and his team developed these pins. Now these pins, the enamel pins, they cost $5, but the $5 that you paid, uh, the proceeds went to support um, the, the local uh, groups looking after wildlife, looking after all those cuddly creatures that were affected by the bushfires. And as a result, um, Wires, which is the uh, one of the Australian companies that are or charities that are looking after the businesses uh, of bushfire animals, I should say, uh, was able to raise much needed funds to help support those creatures. So Rami and your team, again, we thank you. And I'm going to wear this one proudly as we do the rest of this video. Uh, there it is there. Okay, uh, we've got a few extra bits and pieces Ooh. in the box as well. We will put those to the side. Ooh. And let's get this one out, Charlotte, because that is what everyone has come to see. This is Here to Slay, uh, the exclusive edition, and it's got a nice shiny foil uh, box of awesome unstable unicorns there. You can see at the top of the box. Now, the cool thing about this one, I think it's got, and we'll have a look when we take it out. Oh, I can see some rumbles. Yeah, there's a bit of rumbles in there as well. It's got a little magnetic latch on the box too, uh, to keep everything nice and tight. Uh, it looks pretty amazing. Uh, we're just going to get into it because we've already talked yeah. about it enough, haven't we? <laughs> so we have to be very careful with our trusty knife here to bust this sucker yeah. open. Now, uh, once again, Charlotte, what happens when we take all the plastic off? Uh, for um, it goes on the floor. That's right, it goes on the floor. And on every unboxing we do, we always throw the, um, um, the plastic on the floor. But we always clean it up afterwards, don't we? Yeah, after the video. Most of the time. Sometimes. Other, usually, who cleans it up? Mm -hmm. Kind of. But that's it. What do you mean, kind of? Nearly all the time. Okay, so plastic goes? On the floor. That's right. 
All right, let's have a look. We've got a little magnetic latch on the side there, which is awesome. Now here to slay, uh, it's a bit of an RPG adventure. We'll explain the components. I'll explain it to the best of my ability as we go through. It's really smooth. It's really smooth. It's got this little nice foil on it too, which oh, is awesome. It's now, two, two to six players, yep. 13 to 16 minutes, and 10 plus. Mm -hmm. Oh, Charlotte, you can't play. You're only six. I can. <laughs> You've let me play that. Daddy's let me play that thing. I was 14 plus. That's because I'm you're very six. capable. I know. That's okay. That's fine. Uh, okay. Here we go. Let's have a look. <gasps> here we go. Oh so. My goodness. <laughs> someone's excited. So we've got a bit of introduction. Uh, welcome to Here to Slay. What's in the box, etc. Uh, this one is not, not so much a rules booklet. It's more of a rules sheet. Uh, and it's got all sorts of cool artwork in there as well. A uh, little bit of design and layout. Yeah, all the different characters and types of cards. And there's a few extras in here, including a couple of promos that you won't see at retail, which is awesome. I like that one. Well, those are the oversized cards because you choose a leader and then you use your leader to recruit heroes. And you can win the game by either increasing your party to six heroes mm -hmm. or by defeating three of the epic monsters oh. in epic slayer combat oh. uh, not to be confused with the doom yeah. slayer that's a very different thing so let's put that to the side <gasps> look yeah this it's is a door. okay so this is it no it's not a door i'll explain what this is so this one here <gasps> is a dice tower that comes with the mm. game i wonder what's why it's called a dice tower well, why is it called dice? a dice tower it's because there's dice so what we'll do let's close this for now and let's just punch out the dice yeah. tower can i help Charlotte, you can help. You can also talk about your experience with Unstable Unicorns as well. Um, we... So Unstable Unicorns has baby unicorns, mm -hmm. um, rainbow mane. Um... What's your favourite card in Unstable Unicorns? Stop. Oh, you mean the, the Nay cards? Yeah, yeah, the Nay cards. Yeah, the Nay cards. <laughs> Doesn't matter what happens, she's always got a couple of those yes. nade cards up her sleeve, uh, which is really quite annoying, Whee! but that's okay. Building. Yep, so what we're going to do with this one, I think oh. we're going to have Build a look and up. see how it goes. This doesn't look like there's any instruction on how to assemble it, but that's okay. We will make it work. I think... We're going to try and figure this out. Hang um, on, here we are. Let's have a look and see I how we go. Like do you think it goes like that? I think you're sort of right here. Here we go. Let's put this one mm, there. Carefully, yeah, we want to break it. No, we don't, don't, don't. No, we don't, don't want to break it. Do that. I'll try and keep this central too, because I just want to make sure that we're encapsulating it. There we go. And this last piece. And then this one is going to go on there, I reckon, so that we have here to slay facing out. And this or have one. I got it wrong? I think I've got it wrong. This piece. Goes up here. Yep, and this piece with the name board goes on there. Yeah, that's good. Now this is something that the Dice Tower wasn't meant to be part of the base game, um, but they started, you know, getting everyone to support them. You know? um, and they decided to include it as an exclusive. So I believe this is in the base game as well, not just in the Kickstarter edition, which is awesome. So it you looks can see like here you've got, it's <laughs> like a little bed. So you've got the little um, Here to Slay logo, uh, the references to all the different die faces, uh, this little guy with some crazy little bear claws looks very cute but also deadly. Yeah. There's a little, I don't know if you can see it in there, but inside here there's a little cat peeking through the window into the dice oh, tower. Oh, that's, um, that's on the other side, see? Oh, there he is too. Good job. That's cool. So first thing, next thing we're going to do, Charlotte, is dice, grab the dice, dice, dice out of their containers here. Uh, Hang up, they're in there quite go. tight. Wow, they're really in there. Hang Let's up. put the dice tower Let me inside. use my muscles. If I can't do it, then you might not be able to either. That's okay. Mm, we'll... No, out my finger. Wow, let's take that out of there all together. <sighs> this is going to take some time. No, it won't. Ah, oh, there you go. That's Not really better. in there. Okay, so the dice tower, uh, the dice are used for challenges and other bits and pieces as well. Oh, there's space in there for um, expansion. Can, can I test the dice out? So you test the dice out. First of all, test them on here. Make sure they roll them. Oh, yep, they're oh, good. They work. You, got, you got 11 and then you put them in the dice tower, drop them in. And you got a unicorn horn and a four. Now the unicorn horn I think actually doubles as one, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. I never go two. Five and a one, there you go. I'll put Five that to the side. and a one. All right, let's have a look at the leader Ooh. cards here. We're going to open these up for you. So there's leader cards, there's all sorts of components. Charlotte's gone and grabbed all the monsters because that's just how she rolls. Yeah. 
I like monsters. She likes the monsters. She likes to be the bad guys for some reason. That's why she likes to play the Imperials when we do X-Wing. All right, let's see. More plastic. Where does that go? On the floor. On the floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the leader pack actually includes a few extras that are part of the Kickstarter exclusive. So you can see here the Brutal Bow. Uh, this uh, Is this a leader or is this a hero? I think this might be some heroes you can collect. So they're quite, they're like tarot sized cards. There's the back there. And the artwork is just awesome as it was in Unstable Unicorn. Look at that guy. Oh yeah. The cool glowing sword, that's a unicorn too. Oh my. <gasps> and then you've got here the Mystical Maestro. So it's like a musical bar yeah. dude. So oh, these guys have almost actually cross their um, their classes. And if you recruit six heroes, you win the game, unless you kill three monsters first. So you'll be uh, taking your time to stop your fellow folks. You can steal heroes from other players as well. The protecting yes. horn, yes. party leader, the cloaked sage. That's cool. The yeah. glowing eyes. That's awesome. And then we've got the Charismatic Song, Party Leader, Bart. Those are the Party Leader cards. Let's put those out. Let's, who's, where's, where's my cool purple dude? I'm going to put her on top because she looks awesome. look like cool. They can you open mine and I'll show it. Okay, you can show it. Now these ones got to be careful with because they're monster cards. Yeah. So, you know. But, but they're not real, they're just cards. They're just, they're just cards. Well, they might be monsters. We don't know that. They might be real. Well, they're only, they're monsters in the picture, Daddy. I know they're a picture, but they might be based on real life. Already. Mm -hmm. Hang on, let's open it. I'll put the plastic on the floor on this side. There you go. Now make sure you hold them up so everyone can see. Turn them around. Turn them around, otherwise everyone's going to be upside down. There you go. Hold them in the middle so there. So we've got a dragon one. That's a cool dragon. And it, uh, it has... Are they special abilities and things? Yeah. Yeah, and two, weaknesses? Discard two cards. Discard two cards. That doesn't sound very good. We don't want to do that. Yeah, we'll hold <gasps> this one. Ooh. What is that? Some sort of weird mammoth dude? Mm hmm. Yeah. Oh, it does oh. the same thing. Well, these guys have all different abilities, and there's a whole deck <gasps> of these that you'll face, uh, and there's always three on display at any time. So if someone does manage to defeat one, another one is ready to take them. It's another Dark Dragon King. Check it out. That's cool. There we go. What else have we got? Dark Dragon Ooh. King. We've got Orthus, which is like a two headed dog. Rex Major. That's a dinosaur. Yeah. Dinosaur. More dinosaurs? Dinosaur. Arctic Ares. Spider. The Abyssal Queen. Wow, that's cool. <gasps> I don't know. What is, is that? that? Some sort of is that a slug? cauldron. It's like a big slug is dragon. <gasps> oh, wow. wow. Big saber tooth tiger. Yes. Knew the artwork was going to be amazing. Blub <gasps> blub. Imagine a mega slime. <laughs> He's got like four heroes before you can fight him. He's he's tough. Bloodwing. That's cool too. Like Snakey Bloodwing. snakes. Ooh, coward. Is it crow crown serpent? Yeah. So I'm reading things upside down. Oh, and Dracos, the bone dragon. That That's one's cool too. We'll leave we'll leave the bone dragon on top. He. Now these ones are different cards that make up the different decks in the game. Mm -hmm. Oh, the, the main deck, I should say. And there's also a bit of a how to, a sort of a how to. Card, so we'll do that first. So it's ripping the plastic off here, more plastic on the floor, and then you've got things like the how I'll to close win. The box up. Close the box up for now. How to win, uh, what to do on your turn. So you've got your player aids and there. Right here. That's it. Now, what we'll do, let's put it on display. Where? Just there. Mm -hmm. There you go, we can see. You might have to move to the side, sorry darling. Okay. okay, so how to play, and these are a bit of a reference card for all the different classes as well, which are awesome, because there's nine classes total. Uh, you've got thieves, warriors, fighters, bards, guardians, it's, ranger, like scorcher. Scorcher is a class. That's cool. I like that. All right, so then Let's we've got... Let's just the cards, because cards are cool. So there's a standard card size there that make up your hand size. You can use those to recruit the heroes and yep. everything else. And in here we have items. So we've got a practically, particularly rusty coin uh, and they've got yeah. a, a really ring. big ring. That's a really big ring. Ring again. Uh, then we've got what? a decoy doll. <laughs> I think you can use that to obviously... Oh, a fighter's wow. mask. So they have little class uh, icons on the cards as well. So you can see they obviously yeah, that benefit like specifics, Ooh. rangers, Ooh. thief, Ooh. guardian mask. Ooh. Okay, so these are all different cards here. I'm going to rip through these. 
uh, by all means by shooting in high def so you can pause the video if you want to stop and have a look. Modify a card. So say we're playing the game and I decide to challenge Charlotte and we have a die roll off to see who gets the high roll. Charlotte can play this card to cause a minus two yes. to my dice roll because that's what she does. She's yeah. nasty like that. Yeah. Oh, and there is a ton of modifiers. Plus one, plus three, plus one, minus one. Plus four modifier. Now these are the cards that Charlotte probably get every turn, every game. Yeah. Oh. Minus that's like poison. We don't want that. Modifiers. I think this can be played, be played in monster battles as well. That's a challenge card yeah. that will allow you to challenge your opponent to There's a dice lots of duel. Those. Yeah. Well, we want to do lots of fighting in this game. It's a fighting <gasps> style RPG Ooh. ranger challenge. You must have a ranger in order to issue a challenge. Yeah. Obviously, ones for thief, guardian. Yeah. And a bar yeah. challenge as well. The art on the cards is great. Yeah. Uh, it's very um, comic booky, but also cartoony, which is a bit of a, a mashup of genres, mm -hmm. I should say. What's your favourite card so far, Charlotte? Um, favourite card out of all of it. That one. The, and the dragon in the village. Yeah, the dragon, the main dragon, or the bone dragon. The main dragon. Main dragon. All right, let's put the main dragon out then, because he's cool. There we go. Yeah, he's got fiery flames. Now here we've got uh, a bad axe for the hero fighter, destroy a hero card, plus eight. I'm assuming there's some bonuses you'll have to think about there as well. Very wise. So these must be class cards and the borders will help you remind you of who's for what, which is awesome. Uh, a serious, a serious gray, is it? Yep. Here we go. Wild shot. So these are all different heroes you can recruit. Yep. And one of them is on the back of the box. So I wonder. Look, it's so cute. Aww. But he's upside down. No, he's not. He's hanging from a from a bark a branch with his tail. So you must be if when you select your leader hero, if what I understand is true, you can only recruit heroes from the same class as you. Maybe oh. or maybe you've got a maybe you've got to collect one from each class in the game hmm. to get your six. Maybe. Sly picking. Meowzo, oh. the wizard cat. There's so many stuff in this deck. The cards are awesome, aren't they? Oh. Slippery paws, the thief. How about the cats are all the uh, the thieves? That's actually quite cool. Oh, <gasps> the guiding light, guardian card. Oh. It makes sense the unicorns are the guardian class. Yeah. I mean, they've been around the longest with experience. This is the unicorns. Ones. It is. It's, the it's like unstable we... unicorns. It's very much a complex illusion. Then you've got Hopper, the hero wizard. So the wizards are all bunnies. Which is cool. Yes. I think it's in the purple one. Spooky. Wiggles. Wiggles. It's a different kind of wiggles. Everybody's, wiggles. everybody's wiggling fluffy. Oh, Bun Bun the wizard. Look at that. Yeah. Snowball. And Snowball's got this cute little fuzzy name and is absolutely blazing lightning bolts. Yes. Um, so he's, watch out for that. He's them. cute and he's powerful. Melody. These are all bard class ones. Lucky Bucky. Fuzzy Cheeks. Who's a monk bard? It's like mm. Mists of Pandaria. But like, with a no, she's teddy bear. pretty cheeks. Yeah. And then you've got different colours. Looks like squirrels and things as well. And these yeah. ones look like they're negative folks. We're keeping Charlotte awake again, folks. Mm. Enchantler. So these look like they're specifics. Nimble Grey could be promo cards. Oh, a destructive that. spell. I'd hate to be that guy who's caught in the middle there. That's just nasty. Yeah, that's just so nasty. And then you've got. Uh, entangling trap. Ouch. Critical boost. He's gone super saiyan. Enchanting spell. Enchanted spell, I should say. Forced exchange. So these are all your tornado, cards tornado, that um, tornado, cause trouble. Tornado. Call to the fallen. Ooh, reanimate people. Make them come back as zombies, maybe. I don't know. Uh, Captivating yes. spell. And the rusty coin, which we saw before. Yep. And there's some more stuff in the box that we've got to get That's through. all the stuff for Here to Slay in the, the Kickstarter exclusive edition. However, because we're crazy, we also backed a few extras. So, so let's just open those two. <laughs> let's just do it, Charlotte says. Let's just not even yeah. worry about it. So yeah. the backs of these cards here are, are black. So these must be cool. monsters. Yeah, so this is a monster deck. Yeah. Another. And no, 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 Charlotte. Uh, this is another monster deck. What? That's right. So, so what? Like those monsters into the real monster deck? Yes. Lots of monster combinations to fight. I mean, hey, it's called Here to Slay, not Here to Sit Around and Chat. So having more monsters is going to be good. Oh, Alright, so these are the expansion monsters for the game. Let's just set them up. 
Let's just show them up. Okay, let's just show them. All right. So we have the Vault Claw Lion. Look at that guy. Vault Claw Lion. Uh, the Possessed Plush Toy. Now that's funny. I like that. Wow. Imagine if one of your plush animal toys, like uh, not Mr. Meerkat, but another one, came to life. And then you had to use your attacks to like roll dice to attack him and stuff. That'd be a cool game. No, not happy about that. I'm in trouble. The Wicked Sea Serpent. Now that looks like evil card. Uh, and that looks like a grapple. Now this one costs you a hero, but it also costs you a discard every time you attack. So you have to get rid of cards as you go. Whoa, ancient it's, mega shark. It looks like a jumper. It is, it's a shark. An ancient mega shark. Oh, dragon kind of wasp. Cool. And then you've got a wandering behemoth there as well. It looks like an eel. Yeah. <gasps> a phoenix, <gasps> sapphire phoenix, venomous uh, Gemini. It's a really big snake with two heads. That's right. That's going to be Scavenger hard. griffin. Whoa, what is that thing? It looks like a ghost. A clawed nightmare. It is some sort of ghost, I reckon. <laughs> That's cool. We're going to leave him on top. Uh, what was it? Gortolonda. Looks like a zombie goat thing. Goat. Uh, Reef Ripper, which is like a big uh, hermit crab. <laughs> lumbering Demon. Lumbering, because it's tree, it's made of lumber, like wood. Yeah, it so that's very funny. As well. oh, Let's find that claw dude, because he was cool. We're going to put him on top, because yeah, he's awesome. He's so that's awesome. the monster expansion. And we also have an extra dragon expansion, uh, which is just awesome. And there's more on the back of it, too. Well, there is an extra special thing that we've got as Ooh. well, because we're our previous. Yeah, and there's two and more things we've got open, so yep. let's just open all the things and get into it. Well, well, we already are getting into it, so these uh, look like they're extra modifiers. <gasps> so we've got these Kickstarter uh, exclusive um, benefits that we got. Oh, these are the that stretch looks goals. Like a hero from that one. No, no, these are monsters. Oh no, this one's a leader card. You're right, Charlotte. Mm. So this one here is the Fearless Flame, a party leader sorcerer dude, and he looks cool. Uh, and this one here is a monster. This is the uh, like Calamity Mongol. Yeah, a bit of a cheetah causing trouble. Yeah. All sorts of bits and pieces. And so we're going to put them around. in. Uh, and then this is a sorcerer deck. So these are like wizard cards yeah, that are uh, added on. So here we've got um, extra. Uh, exteg I can't read upside down. These cool wizard I names. can read upside down. They're cool cards. Look at that. Little dragon dudes. Mm -hmm. These are dragon sorcerer wizards. Look, he's got uh, a glowing sword. Lot. Loot. Dragon. Smock. Smock. Shamanga. Mm. Mirror you. Mm. I think it says Mirror You. He's, look at that guy. That's awesome. Yeah, he's, he's got a plus 10 modifier. Yep. Plus. yep, yep, yep. I think <gasps> I'm going to be dragon, dragon class. Dragon egg. Hang on, hang on. That's it. Egg of fortune. It's so that's one of the items that we include in the deck. Maybe so we'll put that up here for now. And what have you got there? Is that a dragon sorcerer mask? Uh -huh. So you can have other heroes don the mantle of sorcerer, which is awesome. Just bring it right in the middle. There we go. Cool. Pop it down there. Um, where? Just here. And we've got some final modifier cards. It's a plus six modifier, Charlotte. Yeah. Wow. It's the same. And that's a minus six poison modifier too. My goodness gracious That'll be me. good for you. And that's a sorcerer challenge. So you must have a sorcerer in order to issue that challenge. Obviously your opponent, I think, might have to have a sorcerer as well. But those are all the expansion components that we've unlocked. We didn't go with all the play mats and everything else because we've got our own, obviously. Um, yeah. Now, because we were uh, an unstable unicorn's backer in the past, and because um, Remy and his team look after their backers and really, really big supporters, they included an exclusive card. It's, it's sleeved and all the rest of it. An exclusive card that is exclusively for backers of previous campaigns. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually take it out. I don't know if I necessarily want to, but I think if I don't take it out, then no, you're going to see what but it is. we have to keep this because we have to put it back in the sleeves. We're going to put it back in the sleeve. So this is an exclusive leader card, one of these, uh, that is a bit of a thank you for a loyally supporting campaigns and yes. looking after all that. So it is a new leader card and it is, and it is the Unstable Unicorn, who is a party leader that can don the abilities of any other leader traits. 
It is a rainbow card and because it can be all the that. classes. It can be all classes. So if you or me can be that one, that will go a lot of Well, I think I'll be that. I'll be that. <laughs> you want to be the unicorn? Okay, yeah. we'll see. I'll be the Let's unicorn. Let's pop that back in here for now, just because yeah. it's obviously come in a special sleeve to keep um, it where safe. Where should we put that right at the front? I think we should put it on top. Yeah, so I'm going to put him here. We'll put him just there for now, just because. Yes, yeah, because he's the leader of the band. That's all the here to slay stuff, but while we've got your attention, let's have a look. This is the new uh, travel edition of the base game of Unstable Unicorns. So this yeah. is um, a dulled down version that can happen, or you can take pretty much anywhere. It's a yeah. smaller box as well. Yeah. What do you but think, Charles? Yeah, just open it. But we always have to put it back in the box. Safety first. Safety first, put it back in the box, that's right. Now these oh, are shrink as well. Let's see what we've got. <gasps> now the travel edition, uh, the rule sheet is pretty straightforward. If you haven't seen or don't understand what Unstable Unicorns is, check out the live playthrough we mentioned it earlier. Oh, um, these are just cards from the original. <gasps> they are slightly different, but yes, they've got basic unicorns uh, in them as well. <laughs> So you can play basic unicorns, but they don't have any superpowers because they're basic. So the, um, there's a gentleman across the street who's decided that this opportune moment is the best time to uh, mow his lawn before the rain comes in. So that's okay. So you've got your basic unicorns there. Uh, pumpkin spice is the uh, best kind of spice. Uh, and then hopefully down the track here you'll see uh, different rhino ooh. horns, magic or stabby the unicorn, it's one of my favourites. Yes, because he stabs, stabs, stabs. Because he stabs. Oh, unicorn oracle. So there's some cards in this game that are not in the base game of unstable unicorns. The rainbow unicorns yeah. are staple, the extremely ooh, violent lying. one, oh, the chainsaw it. unicorn. <gasps> Ginormous unicorn is now burping. <laughs> Doesn't have crumbs on her uh, face anymore. The seductive unicorn. Ooh. Dark Angel Unicorn. So this is like a, a, a an amalgamation oh. of all the different games. Oh. Magical oh. Flying Unicorn. Oh. Majestic Unicorn. Unicorn Phoenix that never really dies. Unicorn on the cob. The puns are rife in this game. Black Knight Unicorn. Oh. Shark with you a horn that? on its head. Oh. Annoying Travelling Unicorn. <laughs> Which is specific to I this I think version. it jumps out of this car and just steals everyone's food. Friendly Local Unicorn. So these obviously cars are the specific. Oh. Mermaid Unicorn. To the travel thing. Frequent happened. flyer unicorn, yeah, like that. Ooh. Road trip unicorn, which is cool, big thumbs up. Kiss of life. Uh, Brick and uh, the back kick card and the target of destruction card. Now that's uh, oh, a card from the base target game. Of You're the target of my destruction, Charlotte. You hear that? <laughs> Super unicorn. <laughs> And then we've got here more targeted destruction, two for one, good deal, unfair bargains, retargets. These are all uh, the same unicorn poison shakeups. Uh, blatant thievery, I love it. I love blatant thievery. The unicorns knelt down to steal some of the dog's food, and the dog's going, "Oi, get back here!" <laughs> Change of luck, unicorn swap. These are all the same ones. You can't win if you've got panda and bloke and stable and any cam. If I go too fast, by all means, pause the video. Uh, glitter bombs, double dutch, yay! As opposed to the nays, which are coming up. There's the nay cards that show up. So super nay can't be nayed. So you can nay a nay to make it a yay. Nay cards are instants. Let's stop things from getting played. So that's the travel edition <laughs> of Unstable like Unicorns. <gasps> And, and then we have... Oh, we have one of these in there so we're unicorns. No, this is something different. Yeah. This is the expansion pack for the adventures. So this one is, um, I think, is a combination of some oh. of the travel cards what? we've just seen. What? I know, more plastic. So um, much plastic in this one. So much plastic. That's okay, we'll clean up, it's fine. Yeah. And then we might be able to show you the quick um, things we like about this box. when We'll we... talk about that in a minute, yeah, absolutely, yeah. when we wrap up. Yeah. Uh, so you've got the travel, this is the Adventures expansion front stable unicorns, so it's got the uh, Eager Adventure unicorns, uh, the Land Lover unicorn, <laughs> uh, which is called Glamping Unicorn, who's got a roast chicken uh, inside the tent. Of course, why not? Indoor Rock Climber unicorn, uh, Pillaging Pirate unicorn, Pirate unicorn. Yeah, they look like they have a different ability, so you can choose either or. First mermaid unicorn, bungee jumping unicorn, horn swoggler unicorn, vagabond. And then you've got cutthroat captains. This is like adventurous pirates. Stowaway unicorn, pirate unicorns, fearless unicorns, survivalist unicorn, 
Extreme Adventure Unicorn, Unicorn Shovel. We know what that's for. Uh, metal Detector, uh, The Great Baby Heist. Great Baby Heist, Mysterious Compass, Silver Tongue, Broken Sundial, The Black Spot. Ooh, maybe we know what that. Extremely small black pa backpack, and it's actually on the horn of a unicorn. Is that like, that's cool. uh, unicorn Overboard, uh, Pit Covered in Leaves. <laughs> There's a unicorn waiting to pounce <laughs> and attack whoever falls in the pit. Royal Hooves, Ancient Ritual. Look at that, it's like cave paintings, yeah. probably, but with unicorns. Unicorn Survival Kit. Nay, yeah. mate. Sorry, mate. Nay, mate. These are all pirate nays. A uh, fishing rod. A fishing rod is a new instant card. Yeah. That's it's new. It's a fishing, so when you go fishing, you fishing gun. trip. Maybe. Flare guns. Yeah. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Unicorn net, which is a new one there. Unicorn net. Uh, baby unicorns. These are the new baby unicorns Ooh. that you can condense in. So you can use this deck with the base game or with the travel expansion. Uh, or with, that's one thing about the travel expansion, the travel yes. book. Um, there was no babies in there that I saw. Hmm. That's interesting. Maybe they didn't get enough time to finish me to say, let's get this thing going. Yeah, there's no babies at such... Well, it doesn't look like... That's okay. It's a, maybe a different thing because obviously it's okay. a travel game so it's designed to go yeah. a little bit faster. But maybe they didn't have time because maybe one of the workers that... I made the box said, hurry up, we've got to get this movie. <laughs> the designers decided we need to get rid of it, so let's not put any babies in there. And there you have it. That's uh, all the bits and pieces That's we have it. for you today to do with Unstable Unicorns and Here to Slay. Uh, we are very excited to start taking this one out for a spin using the Dice Tower. Um, I'm going to use the Unstable Unicorn first because I'm awesome. <laughs> We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. We're going to read the rules on how to play. We're going to get a few things sorted um, yeah. uh, and obviously try and get a few playthroughs. Uh, thank you to all our Patreon subscribers as well. We really appreciate your support. Um, if you uh, want to join the Gamer Army and uh, support us on Patreon, jump onto the website. You can see on screen uh, or you can visit us at uh, www.patreon.com forward slash hpgamingau. Uh, or you can, uh, if you have any questions about this game and the contents of this game, pop the, your questions in the comments below, or you can hit the mm -hmm. start of orders at hbgaming.com to the well. Or if you have any questions to me, you can just go to Daddy and answer the questions. Yeah, you can pop them in the comments below if you've got questions for Charlotte, and she'll be able to answer you when she gets a moment. Uh, mm -hmm. The other thing you can do, folks, if you want to find some more great games and other great bits and pieces, jump on to our website, hbgaming.com.au. Uh, where you'll find all sorts of goodies, including uh, this one will be coming soon to the store as well. So you'll be able to get your hands on a copy of the travel edition of Unstable Unicorns. Uh, until then, folks, we've got a plethora of new videos that we've just recently shot that we're working on, so keep checking back every week. Uh, but if you want to stay in touch and let us notify you when something's new, just hit that subscribe button and you'll be sent an email when there's some new videos up online. Uh, thank you very much for watching, folks. As always, uh, get back to the table whenever you get a chance. And we'll see you again very soon. Bye for now.